So everyone, let's move to this picture and I want you to describe what can you see and also to read the sentence. Tell me what you will find when you read the sentence. Yes, objects, objects. Um, you know, um, objects is my favorite word because I'm sure all of you know the meaning. As we have learned in the science subject that object is anything that you can see and touch. Right, everyone? So, let's listen to the word and repeat it. Object. 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 There were lots of objects in the toy chest. Objects. Objects are things you can see and touch. There were lots of objects in the toy chest. Tell about the biggest object you have seen that is a toy. So, everyone, finally, the last word for today. So, we want you to look at the picture and try to read the sentence. So, the word of today is, or sorry, the last word for today is... True. I want you please to listen carefully and repeat. True. True. It is true that an elephant is the largest land animal. Okay, so let me say something about this word. True. What I want to say, listen carefully, okay? People use their legs to walk. This is a fact, right? The sun is hot. This is a fact too, and no one can change this. So, fact tells something true already happened. So, true means fact and not made up. But if I say uh, dogs are cuter than cats, this is not a fact, because uh, people have different opinions about this. Some of them believe that cats are cuter than dogs and some of them are not. So? True. If something is true, it is a fact and not made up. It is true that an elephant is the largest land animal. What is the opposite of true? So these are our vocabulary words for today. So. Let's work together on solving task 1 and task 2. Remember, you have the option to choose which one do you want to do or you can um, do two of them. It's up to you. So, task number 1, there is a box here. Read the words and then try to find the missing word and fill it in the space. So, let's go to number 1. Mom will space the water using the cup. Mom will measure the water using the cup. Let's move to number two. That is an space sand castle. That is an amazing sand castle. Number three. We use these for space for art class. We use these objects for art class. It is space that an umbrella can keep you dry. It is true that an umbrella can keep you dry. The space, five. the space of my cake made the ball move far. The force of my cake made the ball move far. Well then, so let's move to task number two. Here, what you are going to do is to uh, ask the help of your mom if you want to do this task. Read the instructions, please, before starting. And here, write your definition of the vocabulary words. The first two are done for you. And finally, after completing your work, upload a picture or a video of it in your class dojo portfolio please. Thank you and have a nice day.